That is so cool. Thank you so much. Whoa. Look at this. Look at that thing. No way. The stickers. This stuff open. Let's look at it. You saw in other videos, I added some pennies to the weights and got some more improvement. I put the Main Street Cycle Stage 2 kit, spring kit back in the secondary. And uh, they reached out to me and said that they were going to send me their Mud Monster Helix to try out, see if it got me to where I needed to be. And well, this is what showed up in the mail. Got some videos of before, before that you'll see now uh, of the current setup, which I've already explained in my other videos. And we're gonna put this kit in that they sent me to try out. And we'll see what it does here in the dirt. And then when we go to Wild Country Off Road Park, you'll see it again. We'll try and send it as hard as we can. Let's get to it. MSC stage 2 spring. And this is, I guess, a newer or maybe more mud specific spring. The first obvious difference between the two helixes, the SRM3 helix and the Bati Barico helix, is it's got a spot for the snap ring. It doesn't seem like that big of a deal, but one issue I did notice, a little zoom, is my snap ring actually started to walk. It started moving in the clutch. And the last time I had it apart, I had to actually file these down. Actually usable now it is rowdy and high gear uh, I haven't been able to use high gear in a couple of years and, but now I could actually use high gear even in the sand even in the trails I could still use high gear um, but yeah it is this thing's gonna be fun out of wild country I can't I can't wait to bury this thing somewhere it's gonna sling some mud for sure thank y'all for watching this will do it for today's episode we'll catch us on the next one
want to test holes when we send the CF moto through them. <laughs> I don't know. I might be able to make it through this one. You want to ride with me? Already been stuck once. We about to send it on through here. All right. Now we're back actually after part two you'll see that later that video at a later date wow this thing is awesome now it has never been as powerful as it is now even when i had the little baby 28s on it the mega mayhems cryptids are a far better tire than the mega mayhems if you can find those in 28s highly recommend it we had no issues uh the clutch kit performed amazing even with a passenger on the back um in the last clip of the video i had uh, through that that shallow mud hole and you could just hear the engine bog down lose momentum lose power uh, I was with my old clutch setup uh, trying to play around with the SRM3 helix add weight take weight away change springs um, that was the best I could get it and once you piled on you know about this much mud on the machine I mean, this hasn't been cleaned yet let's look around I mean, huge pieces like that. Once you pile all this mud on, it really started to lose momentum. Struggled to turn the tires and super thick stuff. But man, since that Vati Verico Skeg Monster Clutch Kit, I mean, it doesn't matter. It, it it doesn't matter how much weight you got on it. We can we could have this thing completely covered. And you won't even know what color it is, what color the seat is, with a passenger, with a cooler on the back, and the tires just keep spinning, just constantly, always slinging mud everywhere. I mean, this is all mud slung onto itself. I mean, it gets, it slings it all the way up to the snorkels. Uh, in the part two of that clip, going back to that again, you can definitely see my daughter and I run through that mud hole and it just actually let off about halfway through. You can hear the engine cut off. And yeah, it just, I and mean, I was in four wheel drive. The first one was in two wheel drive and you just heard it just struggling, struggling, struggling. But you can watch in the beginning, go back and rewatch it in the beginning. Uh, when I launch it towards that water hole, I'm in full-wheel drive. And it sits there and hops all four tires off the ground in the sand. It just, it doesn't care. It's a game changer. If you are one, if you're mud riding like we are, even if you're not running 30s, even if you're running 28s, I highly recommend the Vati Verico Skeg Monster Clutch Kit. You're going to be losing speed, top speed, no matter what, with the bigger tires and the clutching to change the gear ratio to bring it down. To be able to turn the bigger tires but i mean even when i was on the 28s and i had the msc stage 2 kit it, it wasn't this fast i couldn't use high gear 
it was really unusable, anything outside of pavement. I couldn't use it in the sand, just cruising around even 10, 20 miles an hour. It was a struggle. That I wanted more power, uh, and I knew I was going to go to these 30-inch tires. I reached out to RNG about what I, my current setup, what I planned to do, how my riding style was, and he sent me his primary kit with the SRM3 Helix running the stock spring. Now, while I did gain more top speed in low gear, high gear was still unusable. Uh, it's it's not anybody's fault for clutching. It's just this is a small motor with big tires, and it's not really what this machine is made for. So I, I had a little bit more top speed. It did perform a little bit better than MSC Stage 2 kit, with, where I saw the combination really shine was putting the MSC primary kit back in and then run the SRM3 Helix. That was the best I could get it. But fall short was when you started stacking on passengers, coolers, all this clay and mud on the machine is really when it started to fall short. And that is where the Vati Verico Skeg Monster Helix and clutch kit really shines. Now high gear is back. You can, you, you can cruise in high gear. You can hit trails. 20, 30 miles an hour, take turns in the sand. You can cruise it in high gear now. I've never, I haven't been able to do that in almost two years. Low gear only. So I've definitely really wanted to give a shout out towards the end of this video from Body Verico for sending me the clutch kit to try out and to have a review. Uh, I, they, they're not paying me to say good things about this. Uh, I'm not making any money off this video or any of my social media stuff. They did send it to me free of charge, but holy crap definitely pay for this with my own money absolutely hands down every single time it is a game changer i mean just straight out of the box just put you're ready to rip i'm super happy to be, have this experience with vati verico thank you so much for sending me this thank you for making this possible thank you to all my viewers uh, msc i believe calls it their mud monster kit uh, big tires mud riding on your 600 holy cow you're not going to be disappointed with this. You're really my video did it justice. I'll keep making content again. Stay tuned for round two of this video. Thank you again for watching simply off road.